Hello everyone, Roxas here, welcoming you back to our second let's play of our Ultramoon let's play. Let's get started. First of all, if you're wondering why I'm in this screen, it's because if I remember correctly, there's a special gift for us. Let's see if we can get it. A special rock rock. This rock rock will evolve into dust form lichen rock when leveled up to level 25 or higher between in game times of 5 pm and 5.59 pm. Wow! So that's how you get dust form lichen rock. Give it to me! Tin, 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 tin. Pew pew. Oh no, I can't get it until I get to a Pokemon Center. <laughs> Thank you for playing Pokemon. Please pick up you give from the delivery man in any Pokemon Center. Brrr. And we have already read that. So that's it. Let's get back to playing. Oh my god, I haven't seen this. Ooh, it's so pretty! Look at it, it's so beautiful! Fly, fly. Okay. <laughs> so let's continue our adventure through Alola. I was spinning, spinning in this episode. Yeah. Okay, let's go. Let's go meet Hala. It's so pretty this game. Icky Town. And we're here. This right here is Icky Town. This town is where folks come to worship the Pokemon that watches over Melamele Island. Tapo Coco keeps us all safe and happy, see? Looks like the Kahuna is nowhere to be found, though. I guess there must be some trouble somewhere on the island that needs fixing. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, the Kahuna wandered off without a word to anybody. Singing like a... Diddy or something. I don't know what it means. I'm gonna go stop by home for a sec. I've gotta show mom, my mom Litten. I didn't show my mom Poplio. Hey, I've got an idea for you, Roxas. If you head through the village up the hill, you can visit the ruins that belong to Tapu Coco. That's our land's guardian deity. Yeah. Why don't you go introduce yourself? If you're real lucky, maybe you'll actually get a glimpse of the guardian's deity yourself. Ooh, so Tapu Coco isn't gonna save me from a falling bridge. <laughs> I'll stick around here and wait to see if the Kahuna comes back. So, can I go back to tell my... No. I can't go back to tell my mom. <sighs> I wanna need to show off my Poplio. Who are you? It is said that ancient peoples rode over the waves and seas together with their Pokemon to settle in the Alola region. To settle the Alola region. Ah, it's different when you add the... Different people interact with Pokémon in their own different ways. Some may see them as allies in battle, while others enjoy just sharing their laps with them. That is true, that is true. So haha, you two don't have a place to sleep in. 
Sí, no room, no room, no room. You sleep on the couch. Ok, let's go. Let's... Is there a Pokémon Center here? I want my Rockruff. <gasps> Can I take this? Give me, give me the Rockruff. I'm going to steal your Rockruff. Hey, you've got a Pokémon. I want one too. Where'd you get yours? Wait, isn't this yours? Okay. Welcome to Iki Town, the town watched over by Pokémon. Okay. When I play a Pokemon game, I'll explore everything, so I hope it doesn't get you mad. Ah, and lovely calm days like this one, I always think of my brother. When we are young, we always work so hard to collect sand from the beach. Where could he be now? What must he be doing? Oh, you have a brother. And you are your husband? Opening a window lets night come creeping in. If you leave one open, I'll make you... It'll make you sleepy. Okay, that's... Okay. <laughs> so we're not gonna save Cosmo in this game? If you treat your Pokemon wrong, the Guardian Deity will strike you down with lightning. <laughs> ah, that would be so funny. But the children all laugh when I tell them that. Yeah, I just did. <laughs> I want to meet the Guardian Deity. Maybe I should cause some mischief for a Pokemon. Oh, that's why. You bad boy. Another Rockruff. My Crocraft is the best bodyguard ever. She always comes with me when I go shopping. And she lies outside my door when I sleep. Oh. And you, ma'am? Rockruff, there was a wild Pokemon when we got her. But now she's like part of the family. When I see her rushing with my... What? Rough housing? With my little girl, I can't help but smile. Oh. Hmm. Are you her mother? Hmm. Okay. I'm not gonna say that looks suspicious or anything. So let's have visited that house. There's something in the plants. Bruises. Okay, okay. La la la. What's this? What's this? Okay. So. Okay, let's see. The Cajona gives us wisdom and guidance and teaches us how to live with our Pokemon. Give me an item. Don't forget to save. If you want to remember everything what happened, you must not forget to save. Ooh! Fourth world broken! Oh, Mahalo Trail! Hello. Going to pay your respects for the Guardian Deity? It's a fickle one, but I hope you meet it. Wait. If it's a deity, shouldn't I be, like, praying or something? Or giving him a tribute or something? Ah, okay, let's run. Run, 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 run. Hmm? Oh, Lily's there. Ha ha ha! So we will... We will save Cosmo. But we have a Pokemon now. Hmm. How is this going to change? I know, I know. I'll take you to the ruins. So please stay in the back. We could get in trouble if anyone sees you. Dun dun dun. The stolen Cosmog. Oh. 
Oh, Cosmo. Okay, so this is the same. Chan, chan, chan. <gasps> and Spiro's attack. Okay, so this is the same. And pure Cosmo. Poor Cosmo. Not pure, poor. <laughs> And we're going to save him! Let's save Cosmog. <laughs> I can't believe how faceless our character is. What? Expressionless our character is. <gasps> What's wrong? Uh, help! Save Nebby! It looks so funny. Those people are attacking it, but I'm not a trainer. I can't. Please, please save Navi. I will heal your Pokemon for you, so. Oh, so now we're actually going to battle with the Spearows? Let's see. Chun -chun -chun. I guess we are. Okay, that's different. I like it. A wild Spiro appeared. Go, Johnny! Hmm. Aye. My poor Poplio eats the slowest thing ever. Poplio, use water, Johnny! Oh, you lived! Not so modest. Dun, dun. I'm just going to battle one? Or the three? Wild Spiro fainted. Oh, Jenny! Jenny saved Nebby. You managed to chase off one of the Spiro, but oh, there's still more. Okay, so we have to battle the three of them. Please, please help me if you can. Be careful. But be careful. It looks like that attack might have damaged the plank bridge too. This bridge has a name? Oi. 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 There's still three Spearows, and I protect them with my own hands, apparently because... I don't know. Okay, so this is the same. Explode it. We fall. And step <laughs> coco. <laughs> Those Spearows are gone to another dimension. <gasps> we have a facial expression! Of amusement! Ooh. I'm so happy we have a facial expression! Pew! Oh! Oh, thank goodness! You tried using your power again, didn't you? Oh, Nebby. You know what happened last time you used it? You couldn't move for ages after that. <coughs> I don't want to see you like that again. No, I shouldn't say that. I'm sorry, Nebby. I know you were trying to save me that time. And I couldn't even help you in return. Oh, Nebby. Helping everyone. Wait, what? Wait, what's that? In the previous versions, we saw that there was something... Okay, that's Blink. <laughs> pew pew! A sparkling stone? It seems almost warm somehow. Please forgive me. I'm so grateful to you for helping us out of the dangerous spot. Are you the Kahuna? No. It's us. <laughs> Who are you? I'm... I'm Lily. And I suppose this stone must belong to you. How do you assume that? 
It just... Well, I have it. Thank you. <laughs> Please, don't tell anyone about this. About seeing Nebby. It, it's a secret, okay? Come on, into the bag, Nebby. Pew, Nebby, pew, pew. Um, I wanted me we might get attacked again by some wild Pokemon or, or something. I know it's too much to ask, but to ask it, but do you think you could see us back to town? Okay, let's go back to Ikitao and find, find, find Hala. Do we have to walk all over the snaky path again? Nope. <clears throat> okay, I forgot <laughs> the voice. Uh... <clears throat> oh, Roxas, you already met Lily, huh? She's my assistant, yeah. In my head, Kukui sounds like Crush. Crush? from Finding Nemo, but I can make that voice, so... <laughs> Sorry about that. Lily, I thought you were with the Cajona. Cajona Hala. He said that he had something to attend to, so he left He left town on his own. I was just um, taking a little drop, stroll up Mahalo trial while I waited for him to return. And that's how you met your new neighbor Roxas, huh? He's, he just got to Alola yesterday. Help him find his way around here, yeah? <laughs> so you're also one of the professor acquaintances. It's nice to meet you. The Cajuna is back. Cajuna Hala has returned. Our guardian's chosen one is back. Only one of the strongest Pokemon users in all Alola. Yeah. Was that Kukui? I don't think so. Thank you for Johnny Hala. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now hurry up, because a wild... Wild? Is it wild? Well, my... Rockruff is waiting for me at the Pokemon Center. So... Have I missed something? There you are, Kahunahala. Was there some kind of trouble? Ha 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 I just got up in the middle of some prowling rock rough, that's all. Sorry, Lily. What were you saying before? For some reason I thought I saw Tapu Koko flying about. Oh, um, yes, Kahunahala. Navy got attacked by some Spiro on the back of him at the Plank Bridge. And Roxas here helped protect it. But the bridge collapsed, and I thought both of them might fall to the bottom of the ravine. And that was when the island guardian, the island's guardian deity, swooped in to save him. Well, <laughs> <laughs> that's something you don't hear every day. Oh, although it is said to protect us, our Tapo Coco is rather fickle creature. Yet our our guardian has moved to save you. Kukui, my boy, I think we have we have cause to celebrate. Looks like we have a brave and kind new Pokemon trainer on our midst. I'm glad to meet you, child. I'm Hala, the Kahuna of Melamele Island. Welcome to Alola. Young Kukui told me of your coming. I'm glad we got the chance to meet today. And Cosmo is out of the back. Bad Cosmo. Oh, when did you get out again? I know that Kahuna Hala and the professor will keep you safe from any harm, but you should still stay in the back and out of sight. It's safer that way. Maybe, well, it seems to have taken a liking to you. I, I have read that Pokemon like it when you met them. 
Again. <laughs> I have read that Pokemon like like it when you pet them or take care of them, you know? Alright. There's a lovely gift for me to help make today special, Roxas. Ooh, a gift. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Finally, I have a Pokedex. A Pokedex is a real high tech kind of tool, yeah? <laughs> that can automatically record facts about any Pokemon that you might meet. Your new partner, Publio, is already registered. Oh, yeah, so check it out. Pokeballs? Oh, the training passport. And this is the training passport that I put. I had put together for you. Well, you get to meet the Cajona at least. Ready to head home now, Roxas? Okay, now I can go home. So I can tell my mom about Johnny or not so fast. Oh yeah, Roxas, hold on a sec. <laughs> what is it? How did you forget something? You're seriously asking me that? Who's the one here who forgot to tell anyone before wandering off like a little stroll on a... ...and a sign without a word, huh? Oh, bling bling! Hmm, <laughs> <Drugs us. laughs> uh, uh, Okay, okay. Focus, focus. Would you be so kind to give me a look at that sparkling stone you have there? Take it, make me a C-ring! Yeah, give me a C-ring! Could it be? Toto, isn't that... Toto? You were rescued by Tapo Kopoko at the bridge. Isn't that what I heard, Roxas? Yeah, it rescued me. So it even didn't... Dying? Dying. To give you a stone. Perhaps you are here in Alola, Roxas, because there is. Because this is where you were meant to be. Allow me to borrow this stone for you. Fret not, I'll return it to you tomorrow evening. You have the makings of a brilliant trailer. I can see that light within you, too. <laughs> you must do this the. You must do this the honor of joining our festival tomorrow. Wait, it ended up sounding like Kukui. Uh -huh. I'm a bad boy's actor. First, I'll make. <laughs> okay. First, I'll make sure you get back home safe today, though, Roxas. Lily, you two should come with us, too. Yeah. Wouldn't you want to go losing you twice in one day? Or that precious Pokemon of yours. Yes, I'll keep an eye on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're a little mischievous. Oh, you would you try not to escape the every moment that you were t told not to wander off? <laughs> and now I'm expressionless again. And magically, I'm home again. Oh, Mama, I'm home! Welcome back, Roxas. So, what did you think of Kahana, Kahunahawa? Oh, and look what you've got with you! Bart. His name is Johnny! It came running! How to help you? What a sweet little thing! That's right! Like the meow, out there. <laughs> funny, funny. Like the meow, that's right. Okay. And it saved you. That's amazing. It must have been the fate that you met. I'm using Lily's voice. Oh my god. And I have to explain something very quickly. I'm dyslexic, so if you ever wonder what, why I'm reading so bad, it's because of that. So forgive me. I'll do my best to. Keep a sentence complete. Okay, <clears throat> let's get back to it. 
The two of you look great together. I feel happier just looking at the pair of you. Meow. Bark. Bark. We're one big happy family. Uh, we have healed ourselves. The next day. No, oh, more story. What a stunning sunset. Alright. <clears throat> Today's the day I finally unpack. Okay, so now the bell rings and... If I'm not mistaken, Kukui should be there. At the door. Or... No, it's how that let himself in. Rude boy. What's at the door? Well, go on and see who it is, Roxas. Ahaha! Is it how? No, it's Kukui! Who let you in, Kukui? Hey there, Roxas! It's about time we set our festival. Yeah! But first, I've got something to teach you. Yeah, now that you're a real Pokemon trainer. It's the most basic of all basics. Come on, to route one! Meow. Have fun at the festival, sweetie. I'm sure you'll have a good time with your new Pokemon pal. Me and Meowth will be sure to unpack every last box here. You'll see. <laughs> yeah, work, Meowth. Okay. Let's see. Just run out of my house! Stop it, Kukui! Don't be such a stalker! Roxas, hurry up, cousin! Pretend that you're a Pokemon and use your agility! Okay. Well, I think that's going to be it for today's episode. Uh, because... It was a lot of story, a lot of story. So... Next time... Uh, next time we'll be going to Route 1 to... Learn how to catch a Pokemon like we've never done that before. <laughs> so, thank you for my watching. Leave a like if you did, and it's time to wrap it up. Bye bye!